man on Long Island a possible hate crime against Muslims. And now police are trying to track down who did it. Video shows this crescent symbol, a sacred symbol outside of a mosque in Ronkonkoma set on fire. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lands is live there with the push to catch the person who did it. Shante. Michelle and Liz, that vandalism happened yesterday on the 4th of July in this country, which often celebrates diversity. Instead, an explosion at this sacred symbol outside of this Muslim house of worship. Over a sudden, I hear the explosion. There's no tomorrow. So very, very loud. Imam Ahmed Ibrahim was sitting inside a mosque in Ronkonkoma called Masjid Fatima Al Zara after prayer service when witnesses say two men walked up a hill from their vehicle and threw what Suffolk County police believed to be similar to a Molotov cocktail. I found uh, the crescent in the flame, a big flame. This now charred crescent moon is a sacred symbol equivalent to the cross for Christmas or the Star of David in the Jewish religion. I mean, it's so sad. It is so sad. Allahu Akbar, Allahu Akbar. The mosque opened in this neighborhood three years ago. Religious leaders put up the crescent moon less than three months ago in April in celebration of Ramadan. The violent vandalism happened just after midnight on Independence Day. As American Muslims, we are very proud of July 4th. And in the midst of that, to have a hate crime perpetrated on a mosque that stands for peace, a place of worship, um, it should be unacceptable. Suffolk County Police Commissioner Rodney Harrison and District Attorney Ray Tierney are now investigating the vandalism as a hate crime. It's an isolated incident. We're going to prosecute it, and we're not going to have any tolerance for it. I'm disgusted. Uh, I hate crime towards the Islamic Muslim community is a hate crime towards all Suffolk County residents. And uh, uh, this is something that uh, everybody should be angry about. Hopefully he's caught. Hopefully he gets what he deserves. Hopefully he explains why he did that. Detectives will search for any fingerprints around this statue. They're also asking for any witnesses that may have seen this to come forward.